Hey you guys, it's Sunshine Vibes with the High Vibrations. If you are new to my channel, thank you for watching. If you are returning, thank you for subscribing to your girl. Love and light to you all. I hope everybody's doing good. So I'm gonna tap in and see what messages I have for you all today. Take what resonates, okay? The messages can be reversed. First off, I want to call on the last live section. Or Major Michael, be with me as I channel these messages. Give me nothing but clear and accurate messages for the collective. What's going on for the current energy? Current energy for the collective. One card. Okay, we have loneliness. I know that I'm never alone in regret. I know that I cannot change the past. So somebody wants you to feel in regret because you are alone. Somebody wants you to feel alone and in regret. So someone wants you to feel sad, <laughs> but you know, you know you are not alone. You know that you are not alone. What else is this talking about? you to feel like you wow okay somebody wants you to feel like you have to change your past in order to have a future it's like you cannot go back in time and change nothing that happened in the past if it happened it happened and if you're alone because of the past that's just what it is i'm hearing so it is so it should be make this up y'all so it is so it shall be okay whatever it is it's your purpose you can leave the past in the past you can't change the past you got to keep moving forward i know that i know what i'm here to do and then we have regret again at the bottom of the deck so two 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 somebody wants you to cry somebody wants you to cry but we have prosperity so you're inviting joy, abundance, okay, in many forms. And somebody wants you to feel sad about this, okay? I feel like this is somebody who... <laughs> this is somebody that was in your past, right? Somebody in your past wanted you to feel, okay? Whoever this person is, they wanted you to feel. They wanted you to feel like... Okay, things were not going to work out for you because they didn't want you to change. Somebody wants it to be just like it was when y'all was growing up, but it's not like it no more. Okay, things change, people change, time has changed. And I just feel like you just, you're not interested. What's going on with the collector? Yeah, the magician in reverse, 333 as I say this. So you are getting the spiritual support that you need. You know you are not alone. You're not as interested in this manipulation. It's like a form of manipulation. Someone's trying to manipulate you into not walking away. Someone's trying to manipulate you into not walking away because someone does not see a future without you, okay? This person needs you. We have the three of cups. This person is in regret because this person had did something to you in the past and they cannot change it. But they really want to celebrate with you. You got the hermit. Seven of cups. But somebody likes to live a lie. So you don't want to celebrate with this person because this person likes to live a lie and you have a deep knowing of like where you want to be at in your life in your future it's like you just have some type of knowing you have guidance to which what direction that you want to take and whoever this is they have no guidance okay they have no guidance they have no direction so they want you to feel this way they want you to feel the same way 
Somebody's trying to pull you back in to celebrate because it's like some information that they need on you. I feel like you know this as well. You know somebody's trying to cast some type of illusion just to get some information. Somebody could even be telling somebody, oh, go celebrate with them. Like, you know, maybe you're not talking to somebody, okay? You're not talking to people right now, not someone. There's a specific person from your past that does not want to walk away. It's like, whoever this person is, they're like, no, I can't walk away until things end for them, until things end erupted for them. Like, literally. Clarify the magician in verse. I can't make this up, the emperor in verse. Now, how the fuck is that door open? Yeah, somebody is trying to get in the door. It's not meant for them to get in. Somebody could be trying to attack you spiritually. This person, this is a very specific person, okay? This is a very specific story. So, whoever you are, you could have had a person in the past that was like very, very, very abusive okay this could be any form of abuse this person gonna try to take you out before and you have the strength to move forward you have the strength to you know leave this person behind yeah two of wands you have the strength to be happy okay somebody really wants to take your joy they want to take something away from you somebody feels like you don't deserve it especially without them so they are trying to figure out a, a, a strategic plan Okay, but it's not working. It's reversing on them. Why is it to a wander? I can't make this up. These cards is like repeating themselves. Seven of Cups. This person likes to live in la-la land. They like to live in illusions. It's like you can have a lot of opportunities here and somebody is confused on why what they are trying to manifest in your life is not manifesting. It's because you're too strong. You have spiritual support. You have guides. You have support that people can't see, y'all. Why is it three cups? Yeah. Yeah, what did I say? This person is trying to cause an upheaval here. The tower in reverse. You keep avoiding this tower by avoiding this person. Okay, you're avoiding this person. And this person is really trying to figure out another strategic plan like somebody don't want to give up this work that they're doing on you because of whatever opportunities that you have when it comes to success with this hermit it's giving me like somebody going in a book of spells over and over and over again it's like they cannot figure out a way to cast these illusions on you yeah, they are working too hard. And it's like every time, they could even try to have somebody come celebrate with you. They could have put something in your drink. They could have did something very deceptive. That still didn't work. Somebody's like, who the fuck are you? Okay? Somebody's mad because they want to know who you are, where you came from. They could be trying to search for information, get information from different people. And it's like, oh, why is the hermit here? Somebody just does not want to let the past go, huh? <laughs> Four pinnacles in reverse, but they're going to have to release this. They're going to have to release you. They're going to have to release your energy. It's like somebody's trying to hold on to your energy because you're exposing something or something's exposed about them. Something. Somebody feels like you're exposing them. So they're doing all this work on you because they, they, want, they want you to stop exposing them. But I don't see what the... <laughs> This person, it's like, they don't care what you do. As long as you do not get accolades, as long as you do not achieve anything, it's like, it's okay if you if you are nobody, okay? If you're nobody, if you don't have a purpose, like, who the fuck do this person think they truly are? You feel me? Like, they really think they that they can make your life be non-purpose. Like, they, can, they feel like they can make you live a life of not non-purpose. Like, that's how they feel. So maybe before in the past, okay, you didn't feel like you had a purpose in life. Now you do. Now you feel prosperous in everything that you do. You feel abundant, okay? You change your mindset. Somebody is in regret because they do not like the fact that you are able to release them. Even after they are digging, doing all this dirt digging. Even after they are doing all of this manipulation to get you to... 
just give up. Somebody just wants you to stay in illusions. It's like with the Seven of Cups and the Seven of Cups, y'all. It's like somebody wants you to feel like, you know, whatever it is that you want is, a, is an illusion. It's, it's not real, but it is. Somebody's trying to cast these illusions on you. This is what they're trying to do. Why is the Seven of Cups here? Clarify. Seven of Cups, spirit. Five of Swords. I'm telling you, they are trying to cast these illusions on you. Now they feel like they feel like they can't defeat you. It's like something about you that they cannot defeat. And I feel like it's just mainly God. Because it's like if you were not doing something purpose purposefully like if you were not doing something and feeling like you had a purpose it'd be different uh, I feel like it'd be easier for this person to cast illusions on you because you're not really understanding your mission or you're not understanding yourself but when you understand yourself it's kind of like yeah but what is your true intention because what I do kind of makes me feel good so somebody is confused because you actually are happy why is the emperor in reverse yeah the devil this person is trying to keep you chained this could be an occult leader man and they fucking pissed off this shit is not working on you this is a whole occult why is this the devil yeah the world you completely got a cycle her this is a whole occult and it's, there's a woman here there's a woman here, an empress in reverse. This woman's okay with being tied to this man. This could even be a relationship. So somebody wants you to port up an illusion. <laughs> somebody wants you to port up an illusion with them. This woman is an illusion with this man. This woman likes to let this man dominate her in different ways. And you're not going to do that? So somebody's just going to have to let you go. It's making somebody cry and sad because I feel like this man, this this occult leader, this man do not want to let you go. Both of these, both of this woman and this man are very distorted. Yeah, five of swords. It's like, what are y'all doing? What are they doing? So they are doing something continuously because you are trying to close out a cycle and they don't want you to. This woman really, I just picked up on this yesterday. Somebody's really desiring you. This man wants some type of hold over you and this woman, but it's it's just giving this woman, it's giving this woman, it's, this is the only person they have control over. They don't have control over you. You avoided a tower here. So they could be going through major karma for, okay, doing something to you casting illusions on you, trying to cast spells on you. Why is the Empress in reverse? Yeah, Ten of Pentacles. This is somebody that they have a family with. Somebody did this for money as well. Why is the Ten of Pentacles? Yeah, King of Wands. This woman is also mad at this man for taking these bold actions towards you because this woman's realizing that this man is like obsessed with you. It's making her mad because this woman is trying to get this man to, to just to leave you alone, but this man can't walk away from you until he ends you. It's like he, he it would be this man could have any other woman, okay, with him in this occult, but with you, it's just different because you actually are achieving things you actually are finding your purpose or something that has triggered you into finding your purpose going through this illusion you could have broke a spell off you you yeah, know the devil again and somebody's mad because they just want to end you it's like somebody wants to take you out why is the devil here what about the devil like this man is telling this woman hold on babe i gotta do this one thing before i quit before i stop and it's like she's getting mad because it's like it's messing with her family it's messing with this passion that this man have for her he's losing passion for her 
it's like she's like when are you gonna walk away this man is never gonna walk away from you because you're a real empress this man was dealing with an empress in reverse the whole time so you know somebody is feeling okay they're feeling some type of way they're feeling some type of way they could even want to come to you with a fake apology what about the world for it? Five of Wands, that shit fake as fuck. <laughs> that shit's fake as fuck. That's all they want to do is drama. That's all they want to do is start drama. Because somebody sees that you're happy. They just want to start drama, man. They don't care. This woman or this man, they don't care. They not happy. They want to start some drama in your life, honey. They do not. They don't care. They don't care. Well, that's the emphasis in reverse. This woman's mad. She can't compete with you, honey. She can't compete where she don't compare. Cause you forever, you are forever being guided, <laughs> and somebody cannot compete where they don't compare. This woman's under judgment here. This woman is under judgment. Like I said, you are forever being guided. So whatever this woman is doing, it's like. She's literally making shit harder for their crew, or for them to move away from this. We got the Knight of Pentacles. Let me find the King of Wands. Yep, Three of Pentacles. So this is definitely a group of people that I in deep regret because they cannot keep you chained to them. Somebody wants to do a lot of work on you to keep you chained to them. It's not working. So all they are doing is spying and watching and trying to figure out if you are alone. Somebody wants to do something to you, but they gotta get you alone. So watch out, I'm her. Somebody wants to get you alone, get you by yourself. Somebody's like, yeah, we gotta get them. We gotta get them. This woman really wants to get you because this woman feels embarrassed because this man won't leave you alone. Eight of wands in reverse, but whatever they are doing is backfiring. So, somebody need to watch their thoughts because their thoughts are like literally, they have projections of their own life. So this woman might want to watch her back. I'm Because <laughs> you are not alone. It was the first card. You are not alone. You are never alone. So I don't know what she's thinking. Okay. Confirmation. What about the eight of wands in reverse? So something's definitely going back on them. Knight of Swords and somebody is angry. Somebody is angry the star because you guys are a healer. You could be healing. And somebody, you rejected somebody. Yeah, six of pentacles. This occult expected you to give them money. Yeah. So somebody feels like if you're gonna be successful, you gotta give them something. Yeah, you know? You gotta give them something. If you don't give them shit, they're gonna find a way to try to get you back in the corner, get you begging, get you, get you. It's like I'm hearing one way, another. I'm gonna find you. I'm gonna get you, get you, get you, get you. <laughs> Y'all, I'm sorry, because my guys are so funny. <laughs> Somebody is really saying one way or another, baby. They are going to get you. They going to find you, honey. I'm telling you, Eight of Cups, but you keep walking away. It's like, yep. Catch me if you can. Six of Wands with the Ace of Cups. Because you're still going to be successful. Yeah, Ace of Swords. Things are still going to flow for you, regardless of whatever these people feel like they are looking for. Yeah, strength, because you have enough strength to walk away. Yeah, and you could be manifesting on your own. So this woman is also mad because you can't manifest. Uh, this occult, this group is mad because you can't manifest. Somebody, oh, somebody needs a partner. Yeah, the magician. They mad because you can manifest. You have enough strength to manifest because um, you're a healer. And that's your judgment. It was meant for you to be able to manifest on your own because of who you are. You have all the tools. I said this in a, uh, look at this magician. The first magician's in reverse with the emperor in reverse. So they can't manifest 
Somebody can't manifest without you. You have all the tools. You have all the tools to manifest. And somebody, they don't even have the mind, the mindset. Somebody is looking into the book of shadows. You don't have to look into the book of shadows. You have all the tools. Y'all see this infinity loop? You have infinity of possibilities. Infinity. <laughs> Then I'm hearing Cinderella, so this could be like a Cinderella story because somebody feels like something's impossible, honey. Impossible. <laughs> so somebody's very God for her, for your honey. They are gonna make something so possible. Somebody feels like you just so magical. Yeah, the chariot, because you're so protected. You're really disciplined as well. Yeah, eight of swords. And somebody is stressed out about this magic because they are stressed out. It's going back on there and somebody's in their head. What I say? Somebody don't even have the mind for it. I'm hearing that Boosie song. Welcome to the mind of a maniac. <laughs> Somebody is turning into a maniac. This the mind of me. So much shit going on. Why I wrong? How I go find some peace? They say I'm a role model, but I'm not a role model. Got a smile when I ain't got a tired and still holler. Somebody's tired. Somebody's tired of faking. <sighs> and somebody clearly. That ain't no fucking role model. Yeah, Queen of Swords. This woman is not a role model. Somebody can be mad. Like I said, you a role model. People look up to you. And this woman is like, has a mind of a maniac. <laughs> like, literally. Ain't nothing to I mean, like, I want to say, <laughs> somebody is like, they are calling themselves divine, but they keep on looking in this book of shadows to manifest. There is no way. <laughs> there is no way. You have to look in the book of shadows to be able to manifest. Ain't no shame in your game, because if you got to do what you got to do, but baby, <laughs> I just feel like whoever this person is, they, it's not natural for them. This man is mad about this too, cause I feel like this man thought this woman was like a, a a real empress, but like in our reality, this woman is in reverse. This woman is like a book witch, yeah, seven of swords, and somebody's realizing that. Like this is it's right. This woman get this shit out the books. She's a book witch. Okay, why is the queen of swords with the strength and eight of cups? I can't make this up, and I don't mind. So now she feels the way that they are trying to make you feel. She feels back into a corner. She feels like that um, if you are going to receive some type of offer, there's something coming in for you. Yeah, four wands. Somebody's mad because you are blocking them. <laughs> you could be manifesting a partner or a new home, I'm hearing. Yep. To her find you're manifesting some type of commitment as well or this could just be a solid foundation clarify seven of wands with the four wands whatever you're manifesting it's definitely protected her oh we king of swords in reverse i just turned my nose up when they came out Something stink. <laughs> Something stink. Mm -mm -mm. Why is the King of Swords in reverse? Why is the King of Swords in reverse? Bro? Knight of Wands in reverse. Page of Wands. So somebody is being sexual with another man. And you know this. This is what is hidden. This woman's also mad at you because of this as well. Because this man cheats around, sleeps with her. I'm talking about, this is a cult. They could be trying to pull you in with sex. You know, ten of swords. Somebody wants to end you. Okay, so certainly if somebody is into the same sex, honey, you don't even mess with this one person. Like you don't want to mess with this person. And this person feels like if this comes out, this is going to end you. You don't care. Do what they do. what you do with your wine, baby. 
this woman here is the woman this 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 empress in reverse is the one that is ha is is the one that has to deal with that okay so yeah they might not be able to change their past honey but they're not doing anything to change their future or she's not and she's mad at you because there's nothing that she can do clarify the uh knight of wands and the page of wands and the king of swords in reverse mm -hmm. it's a whole little group they could even be having threesomes uh -huh. This woman needs self-love, honey, self-love. And she's she mad at you because you manifested in a commitment. And she's over her chains to the devil, honey, stressed out, 25, 25, don't know what to do, don't know who to go to, honey. Somebody, like I said, they do what you do. She's a book witch, but don't know nothing about the universe, don't know nothing about God, don't know nothing, don't know nothing about ancestor spirit guides because she don't work with them. They don't work with her. She works with these demonic entities. <sighs> these demonic entities, these entities that are dominating her. Seven of Swords. They lie, they cheat, they deceitful. Ten of Swords. This is not no, this is not no type of cult that you would. <sighs> this is not a cult that you would actually like grow with. These people are, like I said, maniacs. <laughs> They're maniacs. He's a maniac, maniac, oh, oh, oh. Somebody's a sexual maniac. This is stressing somebody out. Cause this woman knows this. Somebody's trying to project all of their energy on y'all. And the magic's not working on y'all cause you're not a book witch. You a real deal. You the real deal. The hard part with the magician. God is is the one who orchestrates your manifestations, honey. I don't know what they doing. Clarify this devil with the nine of swords. Lord, ten of cups. Somebody stressing out about their family, honey. They do not know if they should go or what. Somebody's afraid to leave this man. <laughs> yeah, it's the swords, I'm on point. They're afraid to leave this man. <sighs> this person emotionally manipulates this woman as well. You could have walked away from this, this group and came out of the cold. Because, like I said, it was God. Somebody's wondering, how are you getting away? How are you getting away when they know what they are capable of? Like I said, this witch is a book witch. She's not no, no. She's not power, more powerful than you. She's not more powerful than God. The entities, the men that she worked with, the people that she worked with, they're not more powerful than God. So it's hard to keep you chained. Period. Ace of Swords. Eight of Pentacles. That's the truth. That's how you get justice. That's how you able to walk away and invest in yourself. Yeah, Ten of Swords. Take their ass right out. Every time. Three of Wands. Motherfuckers come for you, take their ass right out every time. That's the truth. And that's the motherfucking truth. Every time. Yeah, love is strange. Holding on way too tight. This motherfucker, I'm telling y'all, I don't know who it's messages for, but somebody keeps, they hold on way too tight. Mm -hmm. Love is so strange. Attempting offer has a high price, so. Like I said, this woman's okay with. Okay with. <laughs> Whatever's going on, honey. Somebody feels like the head witch. Somebody feels like the HBIC with this man. But now somebody needs a safe place to go. Yeah, because it's whatever they are doing is transition to the spirit realm. This is how you know you are not alone. Yeah, a powerful energy shift. And then what did I say? The three fates. This is three, this could be three or more people in this occult. Or this could be couples, y'all. Because we do got the Queen of Swords with the King of Swords. Then we got the emperor with the empress. I don't even feel like y'all out here. 
at all. This is just telling us a tale about what's going on when it comes to you. But what goes around comes around. The three fates. It's always the power of three. Yeah. Something that has to do with your beliefs, styles, and attitudes, energies. It, it's causing a collusion. It, it's, it's causing a storm. Because somebody must choose. <laughs> yeah. Aloha healing. Because you guys are healing. And love is strange. Somebody does not have ancient wisdom. But you see clearly, like I said, somebody don't have ancient wisdom. They don't, they don't have, they don't get this knowledge from within. They get this knowledge from books. And it's cleanup time. And there's nothing wrong, but they get all their knowledge from books. Like they're a book witch. Some of y'all, like I said, it's in you. Something's in you. <sighs> Something's in you. Yeah, your spirit team. Is literally protecting you. What I say, sending entities to attack you. Somebody is trying to send entities to attack you. What's going on? Because they can't get to you. This woman is going in this book of spells and trying to figure out, like, what? Spirit said, "Don't be sorry, help be careful." Because, like I said, this woman needs mental attention. Like, seriously. Less means more. Sometimes it's the small things. So, like I said, somebody thought they was gonna bribe you, cause this woman is easily bribed. But no, you are growing spiritually. You have a real masculine in your energy, and somebody wants to set you up. <laughs> they wanna set you up, set you up for failure, set you up to be a part of their group. Yep, five, five, five. So there is about to be some major changes here. Like I said, this person could be really sexual. They want you to lick them all over. Like I said, somebody is just over sexual. This is a fake masculine. Okay, and spirit could be letting you know that you're feeding into the bullshit again because they're doing occult, doing rituals on divine beings and witchcraft. Okay, I'm telling you. <laughs> somebody is doing these rituals. Okay, because they want you to feed into the, the bullshit. We have Scorpio water signs, so you could be a Scorpio. You could be separated with someone. You could be a Sagittarius. I am chosen. Yeah, she's mad. I love you. So, like I said, this man could be in love with you, but honey, you're not worried about this man because you're a real empress. Okay, we have cousins, family, so this could be a family member. Why are cousins family here? They wish they did you better, okay? Because you're growing spiritually, physically, mentally, and emotionally. Somebody could try to compete with you when they feel like they lost. Because you're expressing yourself. And somebody was thirsty. They have blockages. They cannot leave these karmic cycles. You could be breaking generational curses here. And somebody's doing rituals to stop your growth. Because you're a hard worker. And this person feels like they can't budget. Or you can't budget, okay? Read books about budgeting money. But somebody envies you because they, they try to set you up and they try to block your throat chakra. <laughs> you could have had a psychic abilities, okay? You could have had a dream about this. But you about to get, like I said, there is some helpful people. There is a real emperor energy about to come in your energy. And these people are going to hell. They know they're going to hell. They know they are. <laughs> they know they're going to hell for this shit. They already in here, I'm her. Yeah, connect to your spirit guides. Only the rich. Yeah, these people feel like only the rich can be able to, like, manifest. You got to be so rich and wealthy to manifest. <laughs> but it's your winning season. I can tell you, y'all, them seasons change. Them seasons is changing. They can keep playing. Them seasons is changing. Yeah, these people have black heart chakras. Them seasons is, is changing, y'all. These discord ain't supposed to be in there. The seasons is changing. These people are under judgment. As above, so below. Yeah, powerful manifester. Yeah, gold diggers. These is gold diggers. 
This third party is obsessing over you. Mm -hmm. You release people that only want you for your money. We have God is calling you. Yeah, because something was not your destiny. It wasn't. This is why these people can't win. Because it's, it, was, it was not your destiny. You could be between the ages 29 and 62. Yeah, this person wants you to take them back. But you refocus your energy on what matters. Somebody has a blocked sacral chakra and past trauma issues. Yeah, haters. So somebody's talking behind your back because they still need to heal from some traumas. They don't feel worthy. They don't want you to feel worthy because you let go of your old ways. Yeah, magic back part. You was the one. Root chakra. So somebody is stuck in prayer. This is your past life obsessing over your new life, honey. Okay, these rich snobs. We have four, four, four. You're protected and guarded by angels, so stop worrying. You ain't got nothing to worry about. These people want you to worry about nothing. <laughs> Anything else is for the collective. Yeah, it shit's played out. You're not worried. You're not worried. You're not sorry. And uh, it's like the hating didn't work. They, they start telling lies. That don't work neither. It's like the roller coaster. It's like somebody, they need to get a life. Like, like I said, they need to get a life. Somebody is too invested in you, looking you up. Like, and they really like doing it. Okay, because somebody's into you. But you know somebody's a groupie that wants to offer you a dirty offer. Yeah, because this person has a, a romantic love affair. They have a sex fix. They have different groupies. They mess with different people. And you don't want nothing to do with this. Yeah, they wasting their time trying to kiss your butt. Trying to start drama. Because they ain't shit. I'm telling you because they are down low. And you could be reflecting that this person married for money. Like, like I don't care. Y'all even got enough money to pay y'all to be in this occult, y'all. I'm telling you. This is why they won't want you. Because you are too busy reflecting and your lights are rotating their demons. Oh, yeah, you moving on. Somebody can reminisce about you how they want to, honey. You moving on. You unbothered by these people that's fake flexing, honey. Always partying. It's, it's the same thing. Somebody ran out of time. Somebody run out of time. Give me advice. Here's my advice card. Give me advice. I was trying to not make it slow. Yeah. It is time to stop letting worry for you. Instead, get excited about your future and all it will bring. What energy and emotion you put out comes back to you with a little cautious effort on your part. The happy ending kid it will be yours believe that so yeah somebody is like too worried and invested in you okay resilience is one of the strongest qualities you have it has gotten you through so many trials and tribulations in the past and it will continue to do so lean on that in our tower of strength anytime that you need it you got this so yeah like i said somebody wants you to feel in regret feel sad about losing them or losing something honey you ain't lost a damn thing you don't have to worry about this. However you got through the obstacles in the past, you're learning from them. So the more you learn, you can move forward, okay? No matter what somebody sends you, none of it. Like, this is annoying, y'all. I know this is annoying to y'all too, but these people just don't want to let you go. Come on, Mo. Yeah, we have trust. I trust life and my strengths. Each moment guides me to the light. Everything on my path is placed there for my growth. So yeah, you know, something was only there to help you grow and you are growing. So continue to keep evolving collective. That's all I got for y'all. Love and light. I'm gonna stay out